Hi everyone, welcome to my Photoshop tutorial. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to put eyeshadow on your pictures. Now, first things first is you want to load your image into Photoshop, and you can do this by going to File and Open and selecting your image. Now, once you've loaded it all into Photoshop, we're going to go and make a new blank layer. And you can do this by going to the bottom right hand side and selecting the new blank layer icon. Now, once you've done this, we're going to go and select our color. Now I'm going to go and select a light blue, that should be ok for this image. Now you can follow me or you can have whatever colour that you want. Um, and then once you've found the colour that you want you can click ok. I'm going to zoom in on the eyes, I'm going to select our paintbrush tool and we're just going to paint in where we want uh, it to go. You can be as messy as you like because we can clear it up after, there's no problems about that like that and do the same with the other eye like so just a bit more there and we're going to go and change the blending mode to colour now it's a bit too bright at the moment so we're going to bring the opacity down zoom out a bit now you can have the opacity anywhere that you want it, like there. And if you have gone over a bit too much, you can go and select the eraser tool and bring that down. Zoom in and just take all the stuff that you don't actually want in the image, like there like so. Now if you want to put another layer of eyeshadow on which is easy, it's basically the same as I did in the first place, so make a new blank layer go and select a different colour, I'm going to go for a darker blue this time zoom in on the eyes, select the paintbrush tool I'm going to make that a bit smaller and we're going to paint over the eyelids this time like that, don't forget you can be as messy as you like because I mean we're going to clear this up after like so, a little bit more on there and we're going to go and select the blending mode to colour zoom out a bit, oh sorry about that, change the blending colour again now we're going to put the opacity down like so like that and you can just go back and change the opacity any colour that you want like that, now yours is going to be a bit more better because I mean you'll probably know what colours um, suit the person and you're probably going to have a lot more time uh, on your pictures than I am this is just a quick tutorial on showing you what to do so once you've done that uh, it's all created so I uh, hope you like this tutorial please comment, rate and subscribe there's loads more tutorials coming and I'll see you next time Bye for now.